Caitlin, what morning is it? What day is it? Friday! Yay, we made it! Give everyone, give yourselves a round of applause. It's the end of the work week. Oh, I have to be that person. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bring me back to first grade there. Yeah, <laughs> turning it over to weather now. I mean, yesterday wasn't that bad, but the wind did still sting. Yeah, it did. I mean, yeah, when you're in April, you don't really mm -hmm. love those 20 degree wind chills, but we did have those yesterday. Wind is a whole lot better this um, this morning, but we are still on the chilly mm -hmm. side. So we have a warm up coming. Just uh, got to wait another day or two. It's 24 now in Burlington, 22 in Plattsburgh. Same with Lebanon, 24 Rutland, 9 degrees in Saranac Lake. We warm up okay today. It will be technically below average, but temperatures do climb a bit since yesterday, and that wind will be a little lighter too. Clouds are on the increase. We'll probably have a beautiful sunrise this morning thanks to some of those wispy clouds that are starting to move in ahead of our next system. That's always a sign of change when you get those cirrus clouds, and that's what we'll have this morning. Uh, cloudy by noontime, 40 degrees by then. Low, maybe mid-40s for our highs this afternoon with a south wind, uh, and of course, our next system is following those clouds with some showers that will arrive. I think most of those around the time you're headed home from work and, and potentially through the, the dinner time hour and then overnight as well. Now, it's not just the showers. We've got, of course, the rain out of that, but a little bit of snow, too. Could see in the higher terrain an inch or two of that snow, the very wet, heavy snow. And then that'll clear out just in time for the weekend. And we're looking at a really nice weekend here ahead of us, and that's when that warmer air arrives, too. So some rain showers, I think, at the onset of this, especially in the valleys. There's that wet snow, Adirondacks, maybe even southern Vermont, watches it spreads across the area and turns to mostly rain as temperatures actually climb overnight tonight a little bit. But like I said, especially in the Green Mountains, maybe up towards the Northeast Kingdom, Adirondacks, an inch or two of that snow, that heavy, dense snow is not out of the question before that turns back to rain. Scattered rain by the time you head out for your Saturday morning early. That rain isn't lasting very long, though, on Saturday. Watch as just some clouds are left over by midday and through the afternoon more and more of those will start to break up. I think we have a great Saturday afternoon ahead of us, especially as temperatures continue to climb and we get a little bit more of that sunshine. Broken clouds on Sunday, maybe a few of those to start. I do think at times we will get some sunshine for the second half of the weekend and temperatures do look like, again, they will be above average for the end of the weekend. So after these showers tonight, they might again have an impact on your evening commute. And if you're going out to enjoy your Friday night, prepare for some of those showers too. That's why I put your impact icon there. But for the weekend, we dry up beautifully and temperatures will climb back into the mid 50s for Saturday and Sunday. Monday still on the mild side technically, but it's going to be a rainy start to the work week and we have a chance for a few more of those scattered rain showers on Tuesday and Wednesday and by then temperatures will start to dip again.